All right, guys. So I got to re I got to read the Star Wars number five, and I mean it's it's starting to get to the point where it's kind of matching up with Star Wars as we know it. Um, not completely. Obviously, there's different characters, different like themes, different stuff going on lore-wise. So it's not the same. But like we see the Coruscant cruiser, the Corvette, which is pretty sweet. And uh, it almost seems like that's like right before the first movie starts is where it's about to be. So it's, it's interesting just to kind of see, like compare the stories and how it evolved over time. Um, but uh, it wasn't developed all the way, you know, back, back forever ago. So it's not like people are improving on something that was like pretty decent to begin with. It's like someone just making up dialogue for something. And it was like, she's in love with me and I'm in love with her. Like, I just, I mean, I get it. It sounds totally real because people don't, speak so eloquently constantly but still it just felt weird and certain things feel weird, weird about it where it's kind of like getting trying to reach for something that's not there but i don't know it, it had some pretty exciting like action sequences and stuff like that but it's kind of getting i don't know I, I feel like more talent needs to be injected into this book but either way i'm enjoying it so i'm going to give it four out of five nerd skulls